revealing all about John Lloyd Cruz. John Lloyd Espidal Cruz, born June 24, 1983, is a Filipino actor. Regarded as the king of contemporary cinema by the media, Cruz has top-billed several box office successes. He has more than 10 films with box office grosses of 100 million Cuban pesos in the Philippines. CNN describes Cruz as the quintessential image of the contemporary leading man. He began acting at the age of 15 and has over 30 productions to his credit. A breakthrough role on the soap opera K. Tegel Kong Hinente, where he first started working with actress and frequent co-star Bia Alonso, followed his starring role in the well-known Filipino TV drama Tabbing Ilog, which he appeared in as a teenager, with around 80 awards won throughout his career, including two FAMAS Awards and two Gawadurian Awards, Cruz is one of the most awarded Filipino actors in the business. He was the first Filipino and Southeast Asian actor to receive the Star Asia Award at the New York Asian Film Festival, NYFF, he was the fifth highest-grossing Filipino actor in the 2010s decade, raking over a total of $2.3 billion in box office receipts. A Second Chance is the sixth highest-grossing Philippine film in history with 556 million Cuban pesos. He is currently managed by Maya Salvador's Crown Artist Management. On November 9, 2021, he signed a contract with GMA Network as part of his TV comeback. His first comeback appearance was on GMA's Wowowin, and currently he leads the role of GMA's sitcom entitled Happy Together, pronounced as Happy to Get Her, which airs every Sunday night. Background John Lloyd Espidal Cruz is the youngest child of Luisito Laura and Ida Espidal Cruz. He was called by nicknames Jeward and Edon among his family and some close friends. Cruz finished his grade school at Marikina Catholic School in 1996. He has four godchild Keith Martiner, Cruz, Reiner Cruz, and two other that lived in Doroteo Street, Santalon, Pasig City. He was later discovered by a talent scout in a mall while hanging out with friends to watch Magic Temple. Due to his father's failing marble business, Cruz decided to enter showbiz to help his family recover from financial problems. He first appeared in GMA Public Affairs' reenactment legal talk show Compañero y Compañera, followed by the crime and investigative series Calvento Files. This was followed by several guest appearances and shows. At age 14, Cruz became a member of ABS-CBN Star Magic, where he became an alumnus of Batch 5. He was also a member of the then-teen trio called Coolitz with Baron Geisler and Mark Solis. Television Career since he started his showbiz career in 1996, he was a contract talent for ABS-CBN. In 1999, Cruz played the role of Rovic in the teen drama Tabbing Ilog, alongside Kay Abad, which lasted for almost four years. His breakthrough role came in 2002 by portraying the character of Yuri in K. Tegel Kong Hinente, where he is paired with B. Alonso. He was later cast in It Might Be You and Aikau on Laha Ese Akin. In 2006, Cruz was cast in the highly successful soap opera Maging Sino Man along with B. Alonzo and Curtis and Sam Milby. In early 2007, he began endorsing Unilab's medication paracetamol, Biogesic. In 2009, he made another collaboration with B. Alonzo and played the male protagonist Armando in I Heart Suit Betty Lafia, a Philippine adaptation of the Colombian telenovela Yo Soy Betty Lafia. In 2010, Cruz was paired with Angel Loxon in the critically acclaimed dark fantasy series Immortal, a sequel of the original series Lobo. As a TV host, Cruz had recurring appearances in the longest-running Sunday noontime variety show, ASAP. He was also recruited as one of four members of the Canto Boys alongside ASAP mainstays Vaughn Navarro, Billy Crawford and Luis Manzano. In 2014, Cruz played the role of Romeo in the Saturday sitcom series Home Sweetie Home with Tony Gonzaga, which lasted until he left the show in 2017. He went on indefinite leave from show business after a controversial relationship with model and actress Elena Darna, who was his fellow co-star in Home Sweetie Home. Since 2019, Cruz makes occasional cameos in commercial ads. During the COVID-19 pandemic, Cruz was approached by Willie Revillum to make a television comeback by transferring to GMA Network. On May 16, 2021, he signed up with Crown Artist Management. On June 6, 2021, he made an appearance at GMA's broadcast of Shopee 6.6. Mid-year sale TV event, he would officially sign a contract with the network on November 9, 2021. 
Film Career John Lloyd Cruz at the ABS-CBN Talent Center, May 2010 John Lloyd Cruz starred with Sarah Geronimo in A Very Special Love produced by Star Cinema and Viva Films, which was released on July 30, 2008. The film grossed PHP $179,569,117 at the box office. In February 2009, Cruz's follow-up movie with Geronimo, You Changed My Life, a sequel to A Very Special Love also produced by Star Cinema and Viva Films, hit the box office. The film's total theatrical earnings reached PHP $240.44 million and was ranked as the highest-grossing Filipino film of all time in that same year that I end mid-2009. He shifted from his regular roles for a more controversial, challenging project with Vilma Santos, in which he portrayed Luis Manzano's lover in the movie In My Life. Cruz has been nailed as the box office king for three consecutive years, in 2007 for One More Chance, in 2008 with A Very Special Love, and in 2009 with You Changed My Life, which became the top-grossing film of his career during that time until approximately six years later. Cruz's reunion movie with love team partner Bia Alonzo, Miss You Like Crazy, released in February 2010 as Star Cinema's post office offering, was a box office hit earning more than PHP 140 million in its seven week run and still the second top Filipino movie of 2010. He was later paired again with Tony Gonzaga in another box office film titled My Amnesia Girl that earned 12.8 million on its first day, November 2010, and surpassing 100 million in its first week run. It was directed by the box office director Kathy Garcia Molina. It earned PHP 165 million in its one month run and was the top grossing film of 2010. Plans for making a movie with the Canto Boys of ASAP was proposed for 2011 but was never pushed through. In 2012, Cruz and Alonso starred in the film The Mistress to celebrate their 10th anniversary as a love team. The Mistress was critically acclaimed, leaving a total box office gross of P260, 000, 000, and being the third highest grossing Filipino film of all time. He then reunites again with Geronimo for It Takes a Man and a Woman, a third and final sequel of the film's A Very Special Love and You Changed My Life, which was released in 2013. In 2015, Cruz starred and produced a thriller movie Honor Thy Father, which was first screened in the Contemporary World Cinema section of the 2015 Toronto International Film Festival. He plays the part of a man who, after a period of estrangement from his family, returns home to seek their help when his wife gets them into trouble with violent investors whose money her dad had lost in a Ponzi scheme. Also in that same year, Cruz and Alonzo start again together in the movie A Second Chance, the sequel of highly successful 2007 film One More Chance. The film was released on November 25, 2015 and earned PHP 550 million, becoming the highest-grossing Filipino film of 2015 and the highest-grossing Filipino film of all time. Cruz has been also recognized as one of three honorees of the Star Asia Award at the 15th New York Asian Film Festival, NYAFF. He is the first Filipino and Southeast Asian actor to receive the honor. He joins Hong Kong's Miriam Young and South Korea's Lee Byung Hun, all box office stars in their own countries, as that year's recipients of the award. Cruz won the Bacalino Doro Prize or Golden Jug Award for Best Actor for his lead role in Lav Diaz's Essential Truths of the Lake, 76th Locarno Film Festival on August 11, 2023. Activities Cruz endorsed brands such as Bear Brand Milk, P.S. Bank, Banana Peel, Tropicana Fruit Burst, 555, Sun Cellular, Magic Flakes, Biogesic, Adidas, Greenwich, 555 Corn Tuna, Swatch, DirecTV, Pure Foods Tender Juicy, Smart, Choco Lava, Urban Bags, Head & Shoulders, Lucky Me, Cherry Mobile. Joel Cruz Signatures Perfume Products John Lloyd Cruz Like Him and Likes Her An Aficionado Inspired EDT La Brisa Tower Skin White Bello Faces and Curves Charms and Crystals Geosi and Jollibee He is considered one of the most acclaimed actors in the country and was recently inducted to the Philippine Walk of Fame by German Kuya Germs Moreno in Eastwood City, Libes, Quezon City. His film and television projects are usually big hits with audiences nationwide.